Hey guys, while the deck is open, I'd like to show you one important scene uh, which I spent last two weeks really uh, tuning up my Dragon and 680. Uh, that's a uh, playback and recording had hate. So I spent lots of time and I may say that the biggest issue why I was spending so much time was this tape I get on eBay. It has proper levels, but uh, the height of the head of the deck where it was recorded are uh, sitting too low. That's where it was like uh, giving a little bit different sound on the channels. And the biggest issue I like set the height but I was not able like to find the match between my other decks. And like this pre-recorded tape, uh, I had a problem like, because Azimuth was moving too far away. Like, um, and it was pretty hard to get it because like in different directions, Azimuth was working very poorly. Like, um, so, so that's where I come to you with an like, easy solution. Even if you don't know how to do it and you don't have tools, you have your dragon, right? A dragon is a good measurement station. So put your tape, record it one, side one, put it in, start playing forward, and mention the position. Position should be close to the middle. You see, so this mark almost coexists. And with the proper heat, when you reverse the tape, not just reverse, you rotate the tape, okay? And playing same song, same on the reverse direction. And you should watch that your position goes a little bit in the opposite direction, but approximately the same amount. And that's where like your head would be correct. And your sound on both channels would be good. Because like when I said using this uh, pro tape, my azimuth was going like 30, 50 degrees off in both directions. Like, I'm rotating, wow. And it's pretty hard to, to catch it. So that's where I would recommend you. So that's, you can do it yourself. Just use the proper tape. And as you see the azimuth in two directions goes too far, try to adjust this middle screw on the playback head a little bit, left, right, just make one click, see where it goes, another click, see where it goes. And finally you can make it so it would be close to the center. And after I set a proper head, it was very easy for me like to adjust the azimuth and I was checking that all my decks recording and play back on other decks, azimuth across all of them is the same. And levels are the same, no doubt. So that's significantly improved the sound of my Dragon and recordings when I'm playing in on other decks. Um, and vice versa. So now Dragon plays other recordings. Just this tape plays so beautiful now that it's unbelievable. But it was like, I spent like two weeks digging in, tuning all my decks to make sure that all decks match, that they match to the pre-recorded tape, they match my azimuth tape, and the recordings match between them. Like when I record 10 kilogears on one deck and put on another deck, same amplitude and same phase. So that's how you may make sure that your deck is performed well. Okay. Thanks for attention. Hope this helps you.